the just redeemer with this whole spot this i i just i just want to talk about the places that this conversation is going because we've gone from dildos <laughs> to just a couple of jumps away and we're at birds that eat men alive <laughs> 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 just give a little bit we'll go back to birds that use bed as dildos we'll find a way to make it happen what bird would that be I don't want to meet it it's probably a pterodactyl it, 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 pronounce it right a pterodactyl have you guys seen that that meme floating around what the fuck no Oh, I was gonna go get more to drink. Okay. Um. Uh, P is for pterodactyl, the worst alphabet book in the world. <laughs> I've not seen that one. Justin, take a shot. All right. Well, I mean, there's the um, dodo dick. bird. You told me to take a shot. I don't know what the fuck you are asking of me. Oh, I almost did it too. I mean, if there's a dodo bird, there might be a dildo. So. Yes, eh. the dildo bird. That's. I'm gonna. That's we also bird. hunted that one to extinction, but for very <laughs> different reasons. <laughs> I'm gonna go piss and get more to drink. Actually, the real question is why are grown men talking about fucking dildos? Alcohol. I feel afraid. Hang on, I had to respond to that one. You're the only one talking about fucking dildo. The rest of us are just talking about it academically. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> He's not here. I know. Oh, come on. Go, little pirate ball, go. I'm in. Yeah, I'm giving Justin time. I'm in. Justin, you better run. I'm last place again. Also, to answer the question that I asked Justin, this is the, the level that spawned the hey, hey, you oily mother effers. Thank you, Brandon. Rest in what peace. the hell? Hey, hey, you oily mother effers. What? It's okay. When Justin comes back, he'll explain. Okay. We needed a catchphrase for the channel. Where is Brandon anyway? Uh, Seattle. I'm assuming, um, Megan's family? Yes. And now we wait for Justin. Justin, I know you're peeing right now, but just stay calm. Think of flowing rivers and streams. Nah, uh, let's face it, he's putting some, uh... No one is watching you. Some natural lube on some dildo bird. <laughs> The internet is not watching you pee right now, Justin. It's evil. Uh, oh, God. 60 seconds. 59. 58. Run. <laughs> Come on. Push? Yeah, I guess. If that's what. Do you more mean. cankle exercises? Cankle? Are there cankle exercises or do you mean cankle? Probably cankle. Okay, because cankle is what happens when your calf and your ankle fuse because you're so fat. Exercise that prostate? Ooh. Can I just talk about how much I hate you guys real quick? <laughs> Justin, you've got 30 seconds. Go. Golf. Golf like your life depends on it. Listen. Uh, an uncontrollable urge to laugh mid stream is not what you want. <laughs> oh, God. Boulders. Fucking trying to aim while you're goddamn pulling back laughter. <laughs> Pretty confident that that's not where you wanted to go, Jesse. Actually, no, this has worked out for me. Where's the fuck you Oh, oh hey! Robert went ball for ball and lost. Yep. I'm not in the correct area. So, Robert, <sighs> since you seem to have some, uh, some info, on, what type of natural lube would you use on your dildo <laughs> bird, exactly? Water-based. <laughs> that was way too quick of an answer for someone that has not discovered well, the, the mythical fairness, dildo bird before. 
in the subject of fairness, though, like oil base would just be rude. I mean, I I, I have Jesse? heard bad things about that. I've been with my girl or been with my wife for seven years. Been married with her for three. He knows about dildo birds. Yeah, no, they're an integral part of marriage after the third year. I I get that, but they probably are. You know they're mythical, right? I just want to. Oh, I know. That's why so many marriages fail. I just got hammered by the log. Um, I feel like there's another sex joke in there, but is, is there that is the name of your be? Oh God! <laughs> is that the name? Man, of your you guys beer? are terrible at this. It's because we're married. I was actually talking about golf, but okay. Uh, but, uh, yeah, but uh, there's a correlation. When when you get married, you stop finding the hole. <laughs> I have several questions. <laughs> the, uh, one of them you probably want the answer to. I feel like... <laughs> I feel like Jesse just told us something important. <laughs> Honestly, Jesse, no, just blink did. twice if you need help. I mean, for many reasons, yes. The one that you're... Oh, God, I screwed that up. Yeah, I saw you jump there, and I was like, wow, that was dumb. This takes I, you right to where you want to go. I figured I would shortcut it a little bit, like I did just there. You know what? You know what we've never talked about on the channel that I feel like is worth talking Mental health awareness? Male no, impotence? fuck that. Again, we we just had a long conversation about that. Uh, where where's your where's your name from, Robert? Your shaper name. Uh, way long ago, I ended up trying to find a unique name for um, well, just online usage, and the only like I googled it or whatever, and the only uh thing that used shaper that I could see is uh D and D third ed and that was a Cyanex sub or subclass called Shaper. So just decided to stick with it. That story wasn't as interesting as I hoped that it was going to be. I'm going to be honest with you. That's it was so... like, no, no, it it's above pretty average. Name. It was above but... average as far as like origin stories go. But Yeah, it's usually when you add like of chaos or something like that to it that you really see more of the originality, so. That's somehow more nerdy, though, than the origin of my name, which is definitely the the date of the announcement for the trailer for Pokemon Gold. Yeah, Lit that's like maximum nerd. To, to be fair, I've had this nick actually, this screen name since then. Actually, let me tell you the origin story of my name. I got I got two main names that I I use because one of them is super nerd. Arahinto, which is what I use for like a character name. Double that's vote. Just, that's just a randomized. Oh, hey, me too. What We're do we say ostrich. that was? A vulture? <laughs> sure. Dildo bird and whatever. I'm going um, for a dodo. -do. <laughs> Arahinto is just a randomizer from, from Warcraft. I tweaked it a little bit to make it a little bit like Native American sounding because Torn are basically Native Americans. Birdie. You managed to hit something Japanese, which is weird. Yeah, it actually did end up being more Japanese than I wanted it to be. Um, ostrich. Book of Wisdom, though. Ostrich is bad. You don't want ostrich. No, it's emus that you're afraid of. Ostriches. Well, they won a war against the Australians. Look it up, kids. It happened. Yep, for you Australians, you lost to emus. All right, listen, you fuck. Oh, come on. Tell a story here, you sons of bitch. Continue. It's actually not really worth being told now that I'm thinking about it, but I'm like committed now and I kind of just want to finish. So me and a bunch of my friends back when we were middle school dumbasses all wanted to play StarCraft together. And we didn't know that friends lists existed in games because it was the first time we ever made a uh, like tag in a game. So we all decided when we were sitting there talking in our little middle school voice, that I am not going to attempt to... Oh, please to do. ...recreate. 
high pitchy and squeaky as hell. So yeah, like the I, I people wanna... we kill in Sea of Thieves. Yeah. Um, we decided that we were all going to name ourselves, like, Book of Blank, so that we would be able to find each other in the online games so that we knew who was who. Like, if you see a book, and, and then you know that it's one of your friends. Did it work? I mean, yeah, it, it worked. I mean, like, as soon as we logged in, we discovered that friends lists are things that exist and that it was 100% unnecessary. I think I might be stuck. <laughs> I just got to see that. Okay, Justin. You're almost there. Yeah, except this keeps happening. <laughs> More power. We gotta hit the updrafts with high power. There you go. Speaking of which, I first met Pat way back in middle school during a Japanese exchange or exchange student trip. Ended up being um, a lab partner else... in uh, what biology class? Oh, fuck this whole. Who introduced asshole. me to uh, Diablo One? Hey, I made it. And then I could have been introduced to Jesse and Bob a lot earlier if I would just uh, have went over and played Street Fighter f 4 with them. That probably would have been me and not Bob so much. Or if you had been a cool major, like computer science, the way that... <laughs> well, he would have also had to go to FSU and not cool Yeah. Really? really? You, weren't, you weren't at MSU? Really? No. Why do I, I hang out um, with you? I dropped a full ride to go to Kettering. Wait, you had a full ride to MSU and you didn't take it? I listened to my grandfather. My student loan debt wants to strangle you now. Just a heads up. What do you think mine is doing? I, I mean, I, I get that, but... Wow, I am fucking this whole up something. But in all legendary. fairness, considering what's happened to my family since the time I went to college, it was probably a better thing that I ended up going or having some distance. That's Otherwise, I would not have ended up where I am today. All right. I'm I feel like this is going to be a depressing question, but it's not going to stop me from asking. What does the the school that you went to matching your grandfather's wishes have to do with you not being friends with your family anymore? It's not friends with my family, it's more so of what's all happened. He, um, a lot of events happened in my life that I'm... So, so Justin, his family lives in East Lansing. If he had gone to MSU, he likely would have stayed at home. Some crap happened, and if he had been ho home for that crap, it would have been bad. It yeah, would have been way worse than what it is now. Now you see, Jesse's explanation was totally fine, and now I feel bad for you and I didn't want and I'm holding you responsible for it can we talk about <laughs> I didn't the want to feel plant? bad for you I wanted to hate you as a person can we talk about the piranha plant in the distance oh I god I just noticed the piranha that plant. all hail piranha oh plant. wait you're talking about this and not damn it yeah no the, the terrifying thing uh, I thought that I was talking about smash for a second that would have been a much happier conversation. Is anybody else excited for Joker? Am I the only person in the world that's excited for Joker? I mean, I never played Persona. I'm more excited for Piranha Plant. No, no, well, I'm that's... excited for Joker. That's I'm a... just more excited for Piranha, or I'm also excited for Piranha Plant because it makes all the Waluigi fans sad. Does nobody else have a, like, a, a deep-seated love for the Persona game? I mean, I get that they're quality games. It's just kind of like Skyrim, a game that I've never really had the time to. I haven't played it that much, so. It's true. You need like a hundred hours or something dumb to, like, invest in a Persona game. Yeah, that's the only thing that's keeping me from them right now. Is because I realize that I need to. Not ruin my marriage. It's like I've. I mean, you could. I've though. seen. Patrick play a few of them. I've seen other people play a few of them. I know the general stories because the animes are pretty good. But so, I just don't have the time for it. Let me let me be straight with you. Um, Persona 5, I, I enjoyed it. 
I liked it a lot. It was a little bit, it was a little bit high school drama y, if I'm being honest. And I feel like probably four and three were also that, but I was closer to being in high school and like didn't notice. Well, Why actually, three, um, Persona 5 actually has a. Did I just do a giant? I just did a giant fucking loop. Yep. What the fuck? Right. Um, Persona 4 actually has a lot to deal with a uh, issue going on in Japan with um, like people abusing their power and stuff like that. Well, I mean, all of the personas are are very rooted in like, it's like current world issues and stuff like that. Yeah. Social link with the fox. I don't think I'm going the right way. I don't know what's I happening. I ramped really. off of the geometry in a way that does not make sense because there's... Oh, God. Yes! Finally! Ha! That rock saved me! I know. Thank you, I, rock friend. I made it. Where did Robert go? Oh, he did... He actually succeeded at life. I was gonna say, I didn't hear somebody toss a headset across the room. I think he's still... Oh no, I, I got crushed to death. I can do this. I'm gonna thread the goddamn needle. So yeah, we're getting a lot more real than I was intending to this episode. I guess that's just what happens when we get a little bit tipsy. Yep. Real talk with Team Liquid Dinosaur. I kind of wish That's Brandon was That's not our name here. anymore, you fuck! We're the team of Liquid... Oh, God. Real talk with us. The people that... You dick! Eat a dick! I feel like you I helped... Made you better for me. Yeah, a little bit. I got flogged by a... Lo Is Robert dead? Maybe he did throw his microphone across the room. He does have a small BB child. Like, he does yeah. get distracted. Yeah, he might have gotten made self-conscious about when we told him he throws his microphone. I wish he had a wireless headset, though, so that I could be making him laugh while he's tending to his infant. Because that'll end well. It won't. I don't know how much you know about infants. Hurry up, oh, Robert. You've is. got 40 seconds. Shit. Go, go, go. What happened? I used the restroom. Oh, yeah. Bad move. Apparently so. We made an assumption that it was infant related. Nope. How is your infant, by the way? He's doing well, actually. Um, you see, the way that you say actually implies that I should think there's something wrong with him. Do you know, Robert? Sorry, you were going to make that joke, so I figured I would just go for no, it. No, it's pretty much my luck, so... But no, it, he's Out really. Of time. Oh, son of a bitch! Um, at least I got an achievement. No, oh, he's we're running out of time. Yeah, he's a really happy baby. Um, as I, I mentioned feel... earlier, about the only time he'll cry is really when he's hungry or when he's sleepy. Um, I added the other stuff as a joke a bit, but yeah. It, and I've started to understand patterns. Um, you heard it here. Yeah. Babies are all about math and patterns. Honestly, a lot of humans are. Oh, yeah. You just need to recognize. Um, something, something. We're all chemicals. Something, something complete. The lack of free will of the human. Ra oh, sorry. But in like reality, it's like he's really happy. And... I mean, again, I'm, I'm not going to pretend to know a lot about. I feel like happy is what you want. Like if you if it you're is. not happy. But what you don't want is your score in this game. It is garbage. <laughs> but but no, to yeah, be real, yeah, though, I... it's it's like when he wakes up from a nap or whatever, he sees me for the first time. That giant smile on his face and that open mouth of his its just. Oops. It makes a lot of things worth it. How how oh. old is he now? I just wall hat. Uh, he'll be five months tomorrow. I feel like 
once you get to about half a year, and again, I don't know a goddamn thing about babies. I'm basing this on like coworkers' baby. That's when they start to get like their actual personality and become like people instead of just shit machines. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's that's actually How did really. How did give that in one stroke? I made fun of him, and then he was like, "Shit, I gotta step my game up." No, it's because I was thinking about Isaac. I your baby. Oh God. Well, I'll, I'll look. Take... Isaac has been a source of happiness in my life, so I. No one will ever be able to take that away from you, and that is awesome. Oh God, I've I have screwed up. I might have hit that person in that no. creepy whatever the fuck it was gingerbread man made out of stuff did you hit him in the crotch like I did you see you could tell that I did by the time I said I may have hit him in the dick oh I didn't hear the in the dick oh shit full power in that area is not no, oh come on this is the last hole, by the where way. Where am I? Where am I going? Oh, okay. Why did they put jo Donut Man in jail? <laughs> oh, wow, they did. You we can't jail Donut God. Oh, uh, I mean they have. We need to free him. Here's yeah, Donut what we God. need to do is open a petition. Oh my God, this was a mistake. So those eggs are bouncy, apparently. Heads up on that. Oh, we need to open a petition. Change.org, free Donut God. Yeah, let's do it. Sign so this petition. one of my cats like, is just like subscribe and sign me. the change.org petition if you like this video. Is that not a common occurrence for your cats? <laughs> yeah, it depends. Justin, tell Robert how many cats you're watching right now. Holy shit! You want to hear about how many cats I'm watching? Because I'm going to tell you anyway.